Hi everybody, it's Tati at the Seattle Athletic Club. As you can see, we are still in the middle of the pandemic. Uh, we are allowed to get to one sports court, but only one at a time. So, because of that, we are not able to play yet. Uh, we created this talent program, and the idea is to come in the ball solo, uh, and having, you know, practicing these, these exercises, and improving your swing technique and your, your timing. Come and get one of the practice sheets of the class. It's very shortly explained what the, uh, what the exercises are, and you can mark down your results as you go. So it is a good, good thing to have with you. The level one, the first exercise is two minutes in time, it, and you look for best score, so do the correct consecutive shots without mistakes. Uh, within the exercise, that's your best score. The first one is hitting everything above the service line. And you can go closer to the wall, just go on the stretch and how close you're standing, as long as the wall is above the line on the front wall. You can lay on your back and you can lay on your forehand, as long as you focus on technically keeping the racket space open to the wall is going up. Okay, let's take a look. So I'm going to start first by pulling the ball really high on the side because it gives me more time. And then I keep the ball going and I count the good percentage of shots. So I find the ball, one, two, you can hit the ball on both sides. Or you want to stay on one side, that's okay. Get out of the ball. Strong wrist, open the back of the face. The second one, it's very similar to this first one, but now you have to alternate. You have three minutes in total, so again you put the timer for three minutes, and then see how many consecutive shots you have with the alternation. So you're going to go one here, one here, forehand, lift it up, backhand, lift it up. The third one is a straight hit. And you hit straight over that target. Again, three minutes. How many shots can you play for a second? It is fourth exercise. You're hitting one shot straight, one shot cross court. So you have to combine the, uh, the earlier exercises. And the tricky part here is that you have to keep it consistent. And that's the way you count your top score. So again, you have three minutes. And start with a straight shot. Then let it cross. Turn it. Straight. So when you're hitting the ball by yourself on the court, please put a mask on. Thank you. 